Hey guys, and welcome back to Lost Kingdoms. This is Muffins here, and today we are going to actually continue with what we were supposed to do before we got diverted and chased some yetis down for some herbs. Which, you know, it, 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 that could happen to anyone. That's it's something that, ugh, I don't know. Anyway, uh, we're supposed to be going to Kandari Castle to ask for um, our third runestone to accompany the two that we have already from... Uh, White and... Was it white? Where was this place? This is uh, Shale Passage. Um, from Grail and from uh, that place where we were born. Oh, what's it called? Alanja. So we've got these two and we need the Kandari one to make sure that we're super powerful and we stop the person who... Um, the, the cloaked figure, the person that we fought from getting all the runestones and having bad things happen. So anyway, Kandari Castle, let's just go in. And we're loading, and it's got some pretty cards and the pretty colours. Silence! I tire of your incessant questions. Uh oh. Our guest is leaving us! You there, open the doors! But we didn't know- I didn't even get to ask! Meanie. Mean person. Anyway, who's this following me? Oh, it's a it's a guard. Your Highness, a moment, if you please. Our king is very proud, man, but this is not a proud moment for us. Our runestone has been stolen. <gasps> dum dum dum. We got here too late. The royal guard chased the thief to a mine, but we heard that was the last we heard from them. No thief could stand up to the royal guard, but I fear something has gone dreadfully wrong. Uh oh. Great. The rune state of Kandari has been stolen. The royal guard pursued the thief to a mine, but no word has been heard from them since. Hoping to retrieve the rune stone and discover the fate of the missing soldiers, the princess sets out for the jewel mines. Which are here, the Iprek mines. Um, I haven't actually sorted out my deck yet, uh, which I will do shortly after I've taken a quick gander at this, and I will see you in a bit. Okay guys, I'm back. Uh, the deck name of the day is Snuggles. Snuggles is the name of my badger in Pathfinder. <laughs> Not suggested by Rome, so thank you Rome. Um, I got an even split between fire, water and wood types in this deck, and I've got the Necromancer card in there as well, which is neutral. That's because the uh, the type advantages in the Iprek Mines um, is basically everything but Earth. Earth is strong against water, as we found out in our trip to the Yeti land where I, I got it terribly wrong, um, but yeah, um, all we have to do in this stage is take back the rune stone, easier than it sounds, I think. The jewel mines of Iprek, source of Kandari's wealth, and the lair of the thief who stole Kandari's rune stone. Now who could this thief be? Hmm, this is perplexing. Is it Helena? Maybe it's Helena. It's always Helena. No. Here we are, the creepy creepy mines. We have, um, five fairies in this area. The first one is in this cart. The King of Hindari must be pretty rich. I bet he has nine course meals every night. I bet he does too because he is just that fat. Anyway, um, I don't think there's anything that we have to do up to the left, so... Um, if you go this way, there's a soldier from Hindari. He got separated from his friends. I think he's scared. Why don't you help him? That would be a good idea. I guess I could help him. Um, the excavation area. So let's jump down here with our pretty pretty shoes and talk to the soldier. <laughs> Who's there? Huh? Aren't you the princess of Alanja? What are you doing in a place like this? Huh? You're going deeper in? You know there are monsters and nasty things in there. If if, uh, if you want, I I could go with you. I would uh, protect you from the monsters. I was uh, just going back in there anyway to find the other guys. I I got separated from them. You don't have to worry about the m m monsters Not with me around, I'll take take good care of them. And so we've got to kind of trudge along after this um, soldier, but before we do that, we're just going to pop up here and get this chest. I hope it's not a hobgoblin card. And it is a stone head. That's good because that's one of the type of advantages we needed in here against um, wood creatures. So, um, here he is, he's a bit scared. <coughs> And we have our first match of the level. This is against a, um... I keep wanting to call him Pyro Jack. I think it's a Jack-O-Lantern. Uh, let's attack it with a Flying Ray. And fail. Because he's pretty quick. Let's get another Flying Ray out. 
Come on. Come on. There we go. One hit KO. Pretty cool. It's Jack o Lantern. And we've got some XPs. It's pretty cool. Huh? <laughs> I thought. Nothing here. See? I told you you'd be okay with me along to protect you. Come on, let's keep going. Okay, you keep telling yourself that, mate. You keep telling yourself that. And we've got a Case of Poker card, which is a new one. And another Red Fairy is up here. This is the third one. We're doing pretty well on Red Fairies. I think that'll bring us up to 40. Why do you have all those runestones? Are you a runestone collector or something? Something like that. I have all the runestones! All two of them. Except Helena has one. Hey, you're another monster! Oh, this poor, this poor soldier. He must be the butt of all the possible jokes ever. Oh, come on. Okay. That's a, a castle blippus, I think. I don't know how exactly you say it. Just kill it with the cockatrice, so that's not a big deal. Um, Catobleepers? I've always used to say it as Catobleepers, but I'm sure that's not right. It made kind of sense to me because the braise kind of like bleep! But, um, huh? Okay. We'll, we'll let him think that he's protecting us. Is there anything around here? No. That's fine. Um, we'll just keep going. Um, through the mines, the scary, scary, spooky, scary, spooky, scary mines. Down here there's a nice chest, which we shall open and find the da -da, another cater poker. What's up? Oh no, I took the wrong turn, help! He's got a very feminine voice, hasn't he? Okay. I'm just gonna pop the Necromancer card right here, I don't even care. <laughs> the cater poker, the, the catableepers can't move anyways, so there it goes. It's a, such an annoying monster because of the petrify. It's really annoying. Okay. There we go. I. There's our fourth red fairy. Hello. A little while ago, this really strange looking fellow came through here. He had a runestone. Naughty soldiers came chasing after him, but they all got killed. Uh oh. Okay, so we have our... We have our perp. Um, and we've got a chest up here, which is pretty cool. wonder what's in it. It is a carbuncle, which isn't much use in this area because of the type of advantages. Um, here's the Kendari soldier. Oh, not again! Why don't you pick on somebody else? Because all your friends are dead. I'm sorry. Ouch. That sucked. Okay, uh, what else have we got? A cater poker. Um, I'll attack it with the Chimera. This is um, a card that we got on the bridge when we were fighting the fucking Chimeras, which are hard as balls. Um, and it did a metric fuck ton of damage, so I'm pretty happy that I brought it. Um, so we defeated those two. It looks like there's a chest over in that corner. I should probably go get it. Chest, chest, chesty chest, chest, chest. No, I think that we've um, missed something around here. Let's see. There's, should be a pile of wood around here. In which we can find a fairy. But I can't find a pile of wood anywhere. Uh, so it's this? Yeah, here it is. That's the last fairy for this level. But these green stones sure are pretty. They're kind of shine. You know, Kandari Castle also shines. Well, that's kind of weird, don't you think? Maybe it's made out of the weird stones! Hmm. How about that for a, a little bit of, um... I don't know. Shit. Okay, so, up here. Um... It's not far now. <laughs> I've got a curly voice and I'm scared of everything. Okay, so we got two jack-o'-lanterns. And I've got a crystal rose. Damn it! How did you miss that? I'm gonna summon this land shark. And then try and hit the cater poker with the red lizard. 
Oh, cool. That works. That works too. The jack o' lantern's actually quite a good card, from what I remember. Oh, that was a waste of my part. Go, go, land shark. Land shark is actually a really cool card. Nice. Yeah, that was a that was a good call. Okay. Let's go back to the soldier. Hello, soldier. Hmm. He's not a happy bunny. We can uh, go around here, it looks like. But I don't know if we want to go around there now. I'll grab, yeah, I'll grab the chests here. Rebus, that's pretty cool. Rebus is restore health and cards. That's awesome, another cater poker. How many cater pokers do I need? Apparently I need four. Apparently I need four just in this level. So that's cool. Um, put the Rebus in. Um, the Wisp as well. Oh god, can I take that out? No, I can't take it out. Balls. Okay, well, I think if I jump down there, bad things will happen. Th this is the, the, the place! Yeah, if I jump down there, bad things will happen, so I better run around here and make sure that I haven't missed anything before I do that. Um, yep, there's a chest around here. Might have something nice in it. Let's see. It is a jack-o'-lantern. Awesome. Jack-o'-lantern is a good card. I'm glad I've got that. Um, at the earliest opportunity, I will show you what it is. Um, but, okay, let's uh, follow this guy's advice and jump down here and see if we can get that runestone back. Oh dear, are these corpses? I think these are corpses, guys. Yep, here's the, the sad music. The oh, fuck? Oh, that... Puppet master. I detect a powerful magic coming from this area. I smell a rune stone. Is it mine? Could be mine. The girl. It's her! She has a rune stone! The enchanter would have killed you sooner or later, so you won't mind if I accelerate your fate. He says. Okay, this is our boss fight against the puppet master. Puppet Master has these fucking sucky things that he likes to use. Let's kill this Cater Poker first to get out of the way. Um, get rid of the Rebus and those two. And I will summon the Stone Head and I will also summon this Wizard. Wizard will help us do some additional damage. And that did like 70 damage to the boss, so that's happy days. Um, use the Banshee. Banshee will do a ton of damage. And um, I'll use the Wisp over here to try and get rid of the second Cater Poker. Um, missed my skill shot! I suck! Okay, and that did take care of it like I wanted. That's fantastic. Uh, I don't see myself needing the Mind Flayer right now. But I will summon this Land Shark, I think. And try and get as many hits in with these Red Lizards as I possibly can. Oh. From what I remember, the Puppet Master is a pretty cool card. If I can get it at the end of this mission, that would be awesome. Oh god. It's doing tons of damage. Yeah, I'm gonna die if I'm not careful. I better pop this fairy. <laughs> I remember when I was doing my playthrough, this, like, my practice playthrough, this is where I stopped. Because, um, I died. Um, I didn't even die in this fight, I died way before here. Um, so this is as far as I've gotten, guys. From here on out, it's, it's, for all intents and purposes, blind. Let's try and avoid that. Okay, I wonder how much the Demon Hound can get, because I want to conserve my, uh, cards to make sure I get a better thing so I got a better chance of die. There we go. <laughs> Kill the puppet master. Go, go cockatrice. And there we go. That's everything. Uh, cockatrice gets hella experience. So that's the way it goes. And um, yeah. Um, 
that's it for this uh, level, I think. I wonder if we can examine the corpses. Yep. The Royal Badge of the Kandari adores the uniforms of these dead soldiers. Uh oh. Well, that guy better. I better help, help this guy get out. Well, he better help me get out, rather. Since he seems to be helping me so much. And here we go. This is our next rune stone. This is the rune stone of Kandari. It's going to give us a magic stone bonus. It's also going to give us a HP bonus, which is cool. And that's the level cleared. So, fought a load of battles, defeated a load of monsters, took a load of damage, and... Three stars! I need to be better at this game. Okay, we get two. Uh, what should we pick? What should we pick? I'll pick that one, and I'll pick the fifth one. Come on. No! Lame! I wanted the Puppet Master! QQ! Anyway, that's the Iprek Mines done. Um, we'll pop over to see Alexander, see if he's got some more cards for us. Hopefully he has, because I think we've reached 40, at least. Okay, trade fairies. Brings you up to 43. And he hasn't got anything for us, that's a shame. Anyway, we've done that, we've got our next runestone. We've got to visit Gerd next to see what our plan of action is, but... Um, that will have to wait until next time. Um, thanks for um, watching this episode of Lost Kingdoms. And um, yeah, I'll see you next time.